What a start to Expedition 41, Expedition New England here off of Massachusetts at the moment, right outside of Cape Cod. And we continue to see activity out here in these shoals that's in related to the nursery of these animals. We're seeing animals that are four or five years old. Uh, the kind of thing we didn't see when we were only spending time on the beach back in the day where the bigger animals are chasing seals around. So it continues to be really interesting for the scientists to see that the nursery is overlapping with this mature feeding area on the inside and uh, the sharks seem to keep showing up here on these slack tides. So far we've only been through about six slack tides since we've started working and we've seen sharks in four of those six slack tides. Yeah, it's a small, little small white shark, five to six foot female or something like that. Roger that. You know, sometimes when you work on the water for so long, you take things for granted. And then when they're seen through the eyes of a young person and then they begin to express what they're seeing to you, it allows you to relive it. I took blood samples with Harley, the veterinarian. It was really inspiring and it kind of like piqued my interest and maybe I want to do something in that when I'm older. You hear us at Osearch talk all the time about this is for the kids. This is all about the kids, right? This is about the future and abundance and food for people and an ocean full of fish for people. Uh, and when you bring young people out here that are working on it, you know, that hits home harder than ever. Touching its teeth was very scary. I thought it was going to bite my finger off. That boat, have you been on this boat That before? boat, yep, my dad's boat. It was just kind of weird being two feet away from the shark. I'm not used to it. I wonder why he wanted to start this business. What do you think? Oh, see. I that part. <laughs> to have three of our kids here, really for me personally, I was kind of nervous about it. I was hopeful about it. I got the pride of being the dad, you know, who saw his daughters and, and his son and saw them working with scientists on a shark and they were engaged and they were focused and they were happy and they were thrilled and I was relieved. <laughs> it went so well. One of those expeditions that is impacting me in a way that no other expedition has. Uh, to have the kids, to have hope that one of them's interested in the future of what O-Search does. I didn't know for sure. You know, now I know. Oh, and uh, that changes me, changes everything. So like to only be a few days into an expedition and have seen the animals we've had and have the experience I've had not only with the crew, but the three of our children, uh, it's kind of hitting me in ways uh, that I've never been impacted while I was standing on the deck of the ship before.